This year is coming to a close, and I have at long last completed my first year at Bryn Mawr. This year has been very eye-opening, and I've learned so much about the world and about myself. I am so lucky to be at a school that gives me so many opportunities to pursue my passions and to practice and improve my skills. Unfortunately, my good friend Hilda does not feel the same way that I do. Although she has decided not to return to Bryn Mawr, I do feel that the college has had a positive impact on her as well. She has decided that she too wants to pursue writing and poetry and has finally decided to abandon her study of science and medicine. Just yesterday, I experienced my very first May Day, a charming tradition that Bryn Mawr has during which students can enjoy each other's company in the sun before the dreaded week of exams begins. Each year, the president of the college gives a speech on May Day and the speech President M. Carey Thomas delivered yesterday was one of the most inspiring things I've ever had the pleasure of hearing. She spoke to us about our place in this world as women and the way that men have shaped our society for themselves and for us. At one point, she said something regarding marriage along the lines of, men are monopolists of start, garters, buttons, and other shiny baubles, unfit to be the guardians of another person's happiness. When she said this, I found myself in complete agreement and in awe of her knowledge and strength. It made me all the more certain that I am in the right place here at Bryn Mawr and that this college will help me to achieve my goals and to improve upon my craft. I look forward to my return in the fall and I will speak to you then.